Hey Bell Explorers, it's Chris from TDR Explorer, and whenever I head to Tokyo at Disney Sea, I grab one of these Today Guides right at the turnstiles because it has updated information on what is available for food and merchandise. Now this is essential for your day at the park. Now they do have guides in English, so make sure you grab those too, but they're not as detailed as the Japanese ones, so it's crucial that you grab one of these. Now. It's only in Japanese, but don't worry, I'm going to take you through it today and show you what's inside. And this today guide is for May 1st until June 2nd, and this is during Disney's Easter. That's at both Disneyland and Disney Sea. And on here, we got Mickey in his Usapyo outfit, Tip Top Easter is the show. And on the front of every one, there's a hidden Mickey. So try and find it uh, when you're waiting in that 80 minute line for a journey to the center of the earth. All right, let's take a look on the inside here. Open it up and we're gonna see this lovely graphic for the Tip Top Easter show at Tokyo Disney Sea. Now you can check the English guide. It has the times for the Tip Top Easter show, which is new this year. And over here, down here, uh, this is explained that, so this is the Mediterranean Harbor, Mount Prometheus is here, and there is lottery areas. There's two of them here. And this means you have to uh, enter the lottery to get into these areas. But if you lose the lottery, don't worry. There's lots of, there's ample space to, to watch the show from, so don't worry. Now for the lottery, you head to the Big Ben Beat uh, lottery area, which is by the Gondola Snacks which is when you're walking towards um, Toy Story Mania. And everything's in English there. You scan your park tickets and I'll tell you if you want or not. It's really that simple. So there you go. And up here, this is showing at the waterfront park, all the different Usapyo, which are these little chicks here. They're called Usapyo. And there's photo opportunities and stuff there. So make sure you go and check those out there. Open it up and you're gonna see all this information on what's currently available at Tokyo Disney Sea. So let's start over here with the Easter merchandise. Now the Easter merchandise is available until June 2nd because that's when the Easter event ends. So after that it is gone. You're not gonna be able to get it. So if you're there before June 2nd, buy it. <laughs> and I have a video showing my top picks for the Disney's Easter merchandise and we have more information on our website too with a full list of actually what's available because this is just a fraction just a small fraction up here we have some pens clear folder uh, little memos here i love the cute little designs and a little tumbler plastic tumbler and little snacks and you got this cute little usa peel this is a uh, little i think caramels yeah little caramels inside that's cute we got a towel and we got some generic Easter stuff here. So we got some hats, Easter bunny hats. <laughs> Don't look stylish. And up here, this is also this stuff is available at Tokyo Disneyland. This is more um, resort-wide Easter merchandise. So we got some some memos up here, some correction tape, and little rice cakes here, rice cr crackers, I should say. And we have stationary sets here too. Now, the, this stuff here is only available at Tokyo Disney Sea, so just keep that in mind. Now, down here, we got the Duffy merchandise, and we got some Duffy. This is Tip Top Easter, so this is what they wear on the Tip Top Easter show, so that's really cute. And then we have some new costumes down here. Gelatelli, Duffy, Shelly Mae, and Stella Lou. And you can see the costumes there. Now, just keep in mind that the Duffy merchandise is only available inside Tokyo Disney Sea. You cannot get it anywhere else. And over here, the Let's Play Hide and Seek merchandise. We've got some charms up there and multicolored pens and chopsticks and little drawstring bags there that I absolutely love. And down there, we have a little dessert that looks really nice. It has a blueberry and vanilla mousse cake, and it comes with a souvenir little souvenir plate there. And we have an, another dessert here. 
and it's white chocolate with strawberry mousse and a souvenir cup. And Cape Cod has a, diff a, a new burger with the lunch case. That's cute. And this is a vegetable sauce and beef burger. I haven't had it yet, so I'm not too sure how it is. And we got some more items up here. It's really cute. We have like little lunch cases and towels and stuff. And over here, we have the Always Full of Smiles merchandise. This is also available at Tokyo at Disneyland. And we have some shirts there on the left. And they come in sizes from children sizes up to 3L. And for t-shirt sizes in Japan, you want to go up one more size than you normally get. So as an example, if you wear a medium, you want to get a large. And if you get a large, you want to get an extra large. An extra large in Japan, they call it LL, just for your reference. And over here, we got a hat, Mickey hat. You can see the design on the back there. That's cute. And socks and some fashion glasses. Fashion, not function. <laughs> And we have some, ooh, some cutlery and stuff here. That's really cute. There's plates and saucers and bowls and stuff. And we got some Mickey and Minnie ears, floral and wristbands and stuff, little accessories, uh, earrings there. So that's cute. And let's go up here to the food. So this is the food. This is the Easter food. Just like the merchandise is only available until June 2nd. After that, it's gone. So over here, oh, I love this. I have a full video that actually shows a lot of this food and you get to watch me stuff my face. So make sure you go and uh, check that out. Now here at Cafe Portofino, we have this Carbonara set, which is really good by the way. I know it's a little expensive, it says it's 1880 yen, which is about $18, but you get a full meal with a dessert and drink. It is really tasty. Trust me. And there's an alcoholic beverage that you can get, the sparkling cocktail, and pink grapefruit. And down here at Gondolier Snacks, uh, there's a sundae there. You get a, and there's a nice little plastic cup. And if you like cocktails, much like myself. <laughs> There's a variety that you can choose from. So starting at the bottom left there, we have this citrus. Ooh, it's really good. Citrus, alcoholic cocktail, and that at that's at Barnacle Bills, which is in the American waterfront. And up at the top there, the red with the mint leaves. And this is the cranberry and lime sparkling cocktail. And that is at Miguel's, which is over in Lost River Delta. And in the middle, well, the middle one is really good. I really like that one. This is the Kiwi Mojito. Yum, 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 yum. And this is over at the Yucatan Base Camp Grill, which is also in Lost River Delta. And then on the bottom right there, we have this other one with lychee and grapefruit and grapefruit. <laughs> it's another sparkling cocktail. And this one is at Nautilus Galley, which is actually in Mysterious Island. So you can... You know, drinking around the world at Epcot, well, you can do drinking around Tokyo, Disney, see the different ports. So there you go. And up here, we got some more, some more food, delicious food on the left there. At Sebastian's Calypso Kitchen, we have this teriyaki chicken and egg sandwich. Looks really tasty. I haven't had that one yet. And in the middle there, at the Yucatan Base Camp Grill, we have this Hamburger with barbecue sauce, tomato barbecue sauce, and it actually has a little bit of a kick to it. And then on the left there at the Casbah Food Court in the Arabian Coast, we have this nice curry set. And over here, we've got a candy case available at various places in the park, like at Mama Biscotti's and also at Cousins River Harvest. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to read the names in Japanese and then say it in English. <laughs> I do read these ahead of time, but I can't memorize all this stuff <laughs> it's just so much and then over there we have this drink a nice sparkling drink and it's uh, the blood orange and ginger drink and you can get this at um, Hudson's River Harvest as well there you go and we got some desserts down there with the uh, little souvenir plates so there is a cherry and vanilla mousse cake 
which is on the left there. And then on the right, we have um, vanilla pudding and mixed and milk jelly. And they come with their own souvenir cups and plates there. So that's cute. And you can get that at Mama Biscotti's. And over here, we have another special set at uh, Zambini Brothers, which is one of my favorite restaurants at Disney Sea. And a spaghetti pasta set there with chicken and egg, with a chicken and egg salad, I should say. And in the, the pasta, there's shrimp, just so you know. And then there's also the green apple cocktail, which I just had the other day. It is delicious. So I highly recommend it. And then up top, there's another sparkling drink there, which I missed. And this is lemon and ginger. And that's available at Sebastian's Clips of Kitchen and also at Tropic Hells. In Tropic Hells is in Lost River Delta. And over here, we have a ham and avocado sandwich, which is at the New York Deli. And you can also get the souvenir lunch case you can see there. And there's also a beer cocktail with passion fruit syrup on it. Yum. And we have some items here. Um, over at, what is 46? <laughs> Where is my cheat sheet? Where is it? Oh, 46. Dockside Diner. Uh, we have this chicken and shrimp cold noodle bowl. Oh, that looks really good. Just in time for summer. And then on the right, we have this hamburger curry Doria. And Doria is kind of like a rice casserole. Very popular in Japan. It's really good. And it says that was actually available from four o'clock onwards. That's kind of weird, but okay, sure. <laughs> and down here, we just got some regular food items there. We got the rice, or the Donald rice, which is at Miguel's. And a nice little combination plate there. Uh, taco, ooh, it's taco rice. Ooh, that looks really good. And then we also have the sushi roll with uh, shrimp and chicken inside. And then, just like at Tokyo Disneyland, there's this Winnie the Pooh popcorn bucket. So it's at Disneyland and Disney Sea. And make sure you head on over to tdxworld.com slash popcorn for locations and maps on where to find all these popcorn buckets. All right. Let's look at uh, all the stuff here at Tokyo Disney Sea. There's a lot. Also inside the Today Guide for Disney Sea is this Be a Usa Pyo Friend. And it's just this little scavenger hunt. Don't worry, it's in English too. They have the they have the Japanese here and then the English. So I won't go through it too in too much detail. Um, you just go to the in front of Tower Terror. There's the the Easter Park, which is the waterfront park. And if you look for the these four displays here, and then you just put the corresponding sticker on there. And if you get it right, you can feel good about yourself. You don't get anything. <laughs> and then they tell you to put the sticker on yourself. Cool. There are some closures you need to be aware of at Tokyo Disney Sea for the month of May, or that started May, I should say. So here we have the Mount Prometheus construction is actually going on right now. And last I checked, there's a little bit of construction in the front. You can't really see it from afar if you're taking a picture. Uh, just head on over to our website and you'll see what I'm talking about. And the, const the construction is going until October 2020, so they're, they're doing some work on it. Don't worry, the whole thing is not covered though. It looks like they're doing it in pieces. And then we have Scuttle's Scooters, which is closed from May 22nd until July 10th. And that's over in Mermaid Lagoon. And it is May, so the average temperature is about 18 degrees Celsius or 64 degrees Fahrenheit. So it is very comfortable right now. In the evening, you'll want a light jacket. During the day, the sun is out and you're going to want to pack some sunscreen for that. All right, fellow explorers, thank you so much for joining me today as I showed you the Today Guide for the month of May until June 2nd at Tokyo Disney Sea. And remember, you can pick these up right at the turnstiles, or if you're checking into the hotel, you can also ask the cast members there for them. This has crucial information for your day at the park. It's going to make your day so much easier. And you know what else is going to make your day at the park so much easier? Our ebook travel guide on Tokyo Disney Resort. 
It has everything you need to know to plan the perfect trip. So head on over to our website, tdexport.com slash travel guides, and you can see our travel guides for Tokyo Disney Resort and Universal Studios Japan, which are our premium guides, and we also have free guides on the website too. So head on over, check it out. You won't be sorry, trust me. Do you like how I'm talking with my hands in this? <laughs> All right, Explorers, that's enough for me today. We'll talk to you next month.